Parliament sits on a sessional basis, and each session there is a Queen's speech, and that Queen's speech sets out the government's main legislative programme. The first thing that normally happens is there might have been a draft bill published that everybody can have a look at, even before it comes into the chamber to be debated. Once they appear on the order paper, that clerk will read out the title of the bill. It's the formal first reading of a bill. And that sort of starts the whole process off. The next thing that happens is a debate in Parliament. And it's called a second reading debate. And what that really means is, in principle, what do we think this bill's all about? Members from both sides will indicate what they like about it and what they don't like about it. At the end of that process, it will then go to a committee. And I have much more positive view of Clause 6. Which Basically, it's just like a project team of MPs from across all the different parties. Uh, they go away and they literally go through the bill line by line. So it's a bit like editing a book. Then it comes back to Parliament and the chamber looks at this revised bill and then have that final debate. At that stage, the Commons has really had its say. It goes over to the House of Lords. They do pretty much the same process. They then throw it back to the Commons. We debate that all over again. And then generally, we reach a conclusion about what it should end up looking like. The way you introduce legislation as a backbencher is there's, there's a a presentation bill that you can uh, ask for. There is a 10 minute rule bill that you can again request or enter the ballot.